Coffee, brought to you by the Avalon Mall with over 140 stores and services. The Avalon Mall, still the best of all. With Christmas fast approaching, Avalon Mall has over 150 stores and services to serve you this holiday season. For everything you need to trim the tree, find great and unique gifts, fill the stockings, and deck the halls, just shop Avalon Mall. While shopping at Avalon Mall, drop by and meet the jolly old Delph himself. Bring your list of wishes to Santa and have a holiday photo taken you'll treasure for a lifetime. Santa's hours are 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. Monday through Saturday. Shop Avalon Mall this Christmas. It's choice for the holidays. Good morning. I'm Dave Wheeler with another Would You Believe on stations at the VOCM radio service. Would you believe the old saying that gentlemen prefer blondes but they marry brunettes now appears to have some very interesting psychological foundations. After a career study of the attitudes of 200 college students towards different hair colors, Dr. Dennis Clayton has come to the conclusion that the color of your hair definitely influences the way people think of you. The Utah psychologist explains that the study was designed to find out if people have a stereotyped idea of what someone is like based purely on their hair color. Well, the answer seems to be a resounding yes. Very high grades went to blonde men, for instance. They were seen to be successful, attractive, the most apt to be wealthy. But they were also considered to be relatively simple rather than complex in personality. Blonde women are seen as the ultimate expression of femininity. They're thought of as attractive, rich, successful, and happy, but alas, not overly bright. Apparently, the dumb blonde syndrome is still at work. Dark-haired men are seen as the most intelligent, relatively happy, and successful with no personality extremes. Dark-haired women tend to be thought of as average in every way, normal, familiar, quite intelligent, but not particularly outstanding. It's the redheads who really seem to stir up the most emotion, however. Uh, for men, bad grades. They're viewed as being homely, effeminate, timid, and non-threatening. Also complex and sometimes a little strange. But red-haired gals are just the opposite. They're seen as intelligent, athletic, busy, active, and no-nonsense. <laughs> but really, folks, why don't we just wash that survey right out of our hair? <laughs> and join me this afternoon for another Would You Believe? on stations at the VOCM radio service. Would you believe, brought to you by the Avalon Mall with over 140 stores and services. The Avalon Mall, still the best.